Police claim they have no leads, but there has to be something here. What didn't they see? These bruising patterns are inconsistent with the police report of multiple strikes. The victim suffered one massive blow that shattered multiple bones. These spatter patterns confirm this man was killed by a single large object traveling at high velocity. Reconstructing the event should reveal the murder weapon. The prints belong to Andrew Carter. He has a pretty lengthy record, but nothing that indicates this level of violence. Notes indicate he's been suffering paranoid delusions. Guess he finally lost control. Alfred, I need a last known location for a perp named Andrew Carter. According to the GCPD database, he was released from Blackgate just over a month ago. I'm sending you what I have. Yo, oh, hold on. Mm. There's a notation here indicating he stopped attending court-mandated therapy sessions recently and is believed to be quite unstable. Do be careful. I always am. from his dreams. The one who must be broken. I was told you might come. You killed a man tonight. Why? He saw he would speak. He could not allow it. What did he see? What's Bane planning? I will say no more. Then we're done talking. <coughs> Alfred, let the GCPD know that Andrew Carter's been apprehended in connection with the amusement mile murder. They can pick him up at my location. Well done, sir. That's one less troublemaker for Gotham to worry about.